Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Tony, and today we are doing a Dollar Tree haul. If you are new to my channel, I do mostly unboxings here of beauty boxes like makeup and fashion videos of that sort. So if you're into that, then please consider subscribing. If you are a subscriber already, thank you so much. I greatly appreciate it. Give this video a thumbs up if you like it and hit the gray bell if you want to be notified when I upload. Today we are doing a Dollar Tree haul. I went to a few of my local Dollar Trees and got some really cool stuff. So I thought I would share it with all of you and let you know what I got. So let's get into it. The first item I picked up are some Bratz by Scrunchie, and these are just some little rose gold colored shimmery barrettes. I thought they were really cute and they're really large, so thought these would be nice for holding my hair back when I did makeup or a hair look. I also got these little bobby pin type clips here, which I thought were really cute, especially this one here with the pearl. The next two items I got are by Hard Candy, and one is a bronzer and one is a highlighter, and they come in these really cute little boxes here, and they do say a scratch and sniff on here, so I'm not sure if the actual makeup is scented or what this is about, but one is chocolate and one is pina colada, so I'm going to open these up and take them out of the containers and see what they actually look like and if they do actually smell. Here's what they look like out of the containers. They are super cute in these little boxes. Then they open up and there is the product inside and it even comes with a little brush, which I'm sure is not going to be decent quality or put this on, but it is cute that they included a little brush. They do smell lightly of um, the fragrance that they were. So this one was a pina colada and this one was chocolate. And it smells so familiar, like, like, remember the strawberry shortcake toy, the doll and her hair smell? This smells like the chocolate muffin one. And I don't know if you remember that, if you're from the 80s, but um, this smells so good. It smells so familiar, like, from my childhood. <laughs> So, but these are cute little containers, definitely worth a dollar. So go check your local Dollar Tree out. These are hard candy and they are super cute. The next two makeup items I got are by e.l.f. and they are two lipsticks here. So this one is classy and this one is flirtatious. So these look really cute. These tones are definitely tones that I will wear and e.l.f. you can't go wrong for a dollar. So I picked these up. The next item I found is this hard candy palette and it says hard candy right there on the front and has these little studs and a little faux leather pink thing here but the colors the colors are actually quite pretty and I have not played with this yet but I will definitely play with it and see how it does but for a dollar can't complain the last two makeup products that I bought at the Dollar Tree are eyeliners, and the first one is also Hard Candy, and this is a 12-hour smudge-proof felt tip liner, and this is in navy, which is the only color that they had at the store I was at, so I picked it up anyway just because I thought it would be neat to try it out and see how it does. I don't I think I've ever used a navy eyeliner before, so I will definitely be giving this a try and seeing how it looks. The next eyeliner is LA Colors. The reason I got this is because it is a tattoo stamp. So I'm going to open this up because I'm very curious to see what the stamp looks like and how it does. But this is super cute. Okay, so here is what it looks like out of the package. When I open it up, the top is just a little heart stamp. Let's see it there. Oh my gosh, it did work! That is so cute. Oh my gosh. I'm going to put it on my face. No. Okay, so that is super cute, and I definitely cannot wait to play with this. Super cute. The next item I got is this little makeup bag, and I got it because it says, This is how we roll, and it has a little sushi with some chopsticks, and I love sushi, and I thought this bag was so cute. I love the salmon color of it, and yeah, so. 
The other little case I got is this little cactus sunglass bag. And this one has the little closure that snaps back together. I had gotten some of these in the past season when they had them and it was the cactus design on the other two I have is different but I love these for my sunglasses. I love how the closure snaps back together. You could use them for multiple things but I love having my sunglasses in here. I have sensitive eyes in the sun so I always make sure I have sunglasses in my bag so I love having these little bags to carry my sunglasses in. <laughs> The next item I picked up are these wipes, and these are by Bolero, and these are hydrating facial wipes, and these are coconut and rose hip. Hyaluronic acid, it says fruit enzymes, boosts radiance, improves skin tone. I love coconut and I love rose, and I have dry skin, so hyaluronic acid is always great for me, so I definitely picked these up. The other pack of wipes that I thought were interesting are these, and they are Allure, and these are Night Calming Lavender Facial Cleansing Wipes, and they looked really interesting to me. I love lavender and night calming and essential oils and all that stuff, so I thought I would give these ones a try as well. The next item that I got, I got in two different scents actually, and these are new to the dollar store, and I looked several different stores to find these. I could only find these two scents. I think there are more, but I could only find these two. I wish I could find more, but I got the Cherry Blossom and the Sweet Love, and these are bubble bars. Now, I have used Lush bubble bars in the past, and I loved them. I'm not saying that these dollar store bubble bars are going to compare, but I am definitely going to try them out and see how they do. They both definitely smell really good. I don't, I don't know what one I like better, but they, they both smell really good to me, so I am happy with them, and I cannot wait to try them out. The next item that I got is this, and this is Salt Range Himalayan Pink Sea Salt Bath Salts, and this is 100% natural pure, up to 84 plus minerals, and this is quite a large package, in my opinion, for a dollar, so I definitely picked this up. And I cannot wait to use these. I love using bath salts in my bath. These are the last three items that I picked up at the dollar store for this haul. These are also bath salts, and these are all different. And I've tried a few of these before, and I really enjoy them. So we have Village Naturals Therapy, and this is Aches and Pains Nighttime Relief. This one is Aches and Pains Tension Relief. And this one is Aches and Pains Muscle Relief. So I have tried the Muscle Relief before and I believe the Nighttime Relief. So I'm excited to try the Tension Relief because I haven't tried it before. But like I said, I love bath salts. I really think they help with aches and pains. My heels hurt a lot because I walk really hard. So I like to take baths and use these to make my muscles feel better. After I kickbox, these are great. After you're sick, if you have a cold or a flu and the body aches, these are amazing to soak in. They feel so amazing. They take the aches away. It's just relaxing and I love them, like I said. <laughs> so anyway, I was happy to find these at the dollar store. These are one-time uses. You can get these at Walmart in large bags. That's how I used to get them, but I thought since I was there and saw them, in, I would pick them up for my baths. That is everything that I have for you in this Dollar Tree haul. I thought there was some really great deals at the Dollar Tree lately. They have some really nice name brand stuff and, they are, and I really enjoy going there and shopping. I always seem to find really cool things to get so I thought I would share with you guys what I got this time because I love going there and like I said, you can't beat it for a dollar. <laughs> So thank you everyone for sticking around and watching me unbag my Dollar Tree haul. Thank you for listening to me babble. If you are a subscriber already, thank you so much. I greatly appreciate it. If you are not, please consider subscribing. I do mostly unboxings of beauty, makeup, fashion videos on this channel. So if you are into that, then please consider joining us. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Hit the gray bell if you want to be notified when I upload. I hope everyone has a great week and I will see you all in the next one. Mm -hmm.